they didn't want to see you make it. They didn't want to see you succeed. They didn't want to see you get to the level that you are at, are at now. They wanted you to fold. They wanted you to be in a corner somewhere crying. Asking, please, anyone help me. They wanted you to be a coward. I'm going to just say it. But since do you know, since you're not a coward, since you're not in a corner begging and asking, please help me somebody. Please help me somebody. These people is mad at you. These people is pissed off at you because you fought your inner strength. You fought your inner lion. And now that you have picked yourself back up and you have you are thriving, now they are pissed. Because they like how she, how he picked themselves up. How they thriving. How they handling themselves. How they for some of y'all they like how they taking care of theyself. For some of y'all they can't even believe that you taking care of yourself. Because they were so used to you just like looking a mess, being a mess. Even if you was looking good, you was a mess in the inside. They were just so used to that. They were so used to you coming to them with they pro coming to coming to them with your problems, being the one that have the least, and they being the one that have the most. They were so used to laughing at your suffering. They were so used to that. But now that you out of that season, ooh, God, thank you, Jesus. Now that you are out of that season, they can't recognize you. They is literally saying, who do she or he think that they are? To come out of the pit that they, I'm so used to them being in. You guys, you got people in your life. For some of y'all, this family too. You got people in your life that is used to you being at the bottom. They have got used to that. They're not used to you being nowhere else but at the bottom, beneath them. And now that you are rising up. See, see, this is the problem. You're passing their level. For some of you guys, you have passed their level. And they just cannot believe it because they like he and she was just in the pit. They was just down and out. They was just, they ain't, just, they just didn't have nothing. They was just asking me for something. How is that? They is thriving. Like, this is crazy. This is crazy. What had, who gave them these powers? Who gave them these gifts to be able to rise up? What I never saw this person getting out of what they was in. For some of y'all, y'all was near death, near death. For some of y'all, y'all just was so down for so long that this person had made that a permanent stamp on your life. And I, I, the, this is people that y'all got close to y'all. These is friends, family. These is people that you confide in in your deepest, weakest moments. That is looking at you like I just knew she was going to be in that position forever. I knew he was going to be in that position forever. They, they, they didn't know who you was. And I'm going to be honest with you. They didn't care who you was. All they cared about was their perception of who you was. Do you understand what I'm saying, family? You got people in your life right now that is family. That is looking at you like you always going to be in a bottom beneath their feet. You got friends that is looking at you right now like you always going to be beneath them. But in your face, they like, I love you. I care about you. I Like, I want the best for you. You don't know that these people, they don't care. They These people, for some of y'all, y'all once had it all. And now you kind of feel short because life gets hard. But some of these people, they rejoiced in your, ooh, thank you, Jesus. They rejoiced in your pain. They rejoiced in your suffering. See, some of these people that hugged you when you was crying, you didn't know. As soon as you got done crying, as soon as they left your sight, they was rejoicing in your pain. They was like, that's what he get. That's what she get always being successful over me. But they don't know what God is finna do in your life. Ooh, Jesus. What God is finna do in your life, they finna have to eat them words and it's gonna, ooh, when I tell you it's gonna take them out, family. It's going to take them out. I love you guys. Stay blessed.